Okay, what you what you will see when you open up Cash Renegade, uh, when you know, install the little Cash Renegade program from the icon that I showed you on the post. Uh, here, when you open up the program and you install, you double click on the Cash Renegade icon, and it will install a little program for you. And once it does, and you go in, you open it up. This is what you get. First thing you need to do is click on Settings and License, and you want to log in. Okay. Uh, let's do that again, just so you can see. Uh, uh -huh. Just quickly get a little thing like a little thing like that, and ask you for your password and all. You know, log in. So you need to do that, and then you hit this button. You'll have a splash screen here. You'll hit this button, and uh, again comes to this. Automatically populates your whatever you put in that settings box and it logs you in. Okay. Um, so then you want to go in and start filling this out. The first line is the address for your website and um, so I put in in there this address without the uh, left, you know without the date on it just the base address so let me take that off for you so you would put in your URL which you can copy it and paste it in okay so that goes that goes in here then your key your niche keyword and they suggest in the training video to use one keyword or key phrase so this website is going to be about article marketing so I use article marketing then you can figure out where you want to get articles from and since I'm a member of Ezon articles and I know they have really good articles I chose Ezon articles for this one I might go to the other ones through the videos but we'll go for Ezon articles now post frequency I'm choosing daily I want to post you know a couple posts every day you must use the proxies, and I'm not going to go into the details about all this. They do have a short proxy list that they use, um, but they explain to you that you may want to find your own proxies because their proxies are probably overrated. What this is, ladies and gentlemen, is what I'm telling you all the time not to use, but I'm going to do this once for, you know, use this software for a few days for you so you can see exactly what happens when you fall prey to these proxy softwares, these robot softwares. Um, they're irritating. Most people are becoming very wary of them. So, um, you know, like I say, I don't want you to have to fall prey to it, and I don't want you to waste your time and money on it. Anyway, spin content. You can spin just the titles. You can spin just the body, or you can spin the titles and the body. They recommend you choose the spin titles and body so that each article will be what what they do. What spinning an article is, or spinning the titles, spinning the body. What happens is the software goes through the article and looks for certain key, certain words. And if there is a synonym for those words, then it will replace it with another word. Okay. Um, so we have might have uh, the word "come." It'll find a synonym to, synonym to replace it. Um, the next thing it wanted you to do is. Okay, harvest proxies. You want to harvest and clean your proxies before you set it to go. And what that's supposed to be doing is there's your proxy files. Um, and these are the files that it's going to give you. Okay, so it's going to go through the proxies. And uh, you can see you can buy proxies. Interesting. It's, it's going to run my harvest. It's going to harvest my proxies. Okay. It's not working. Third one, so we have one, see it here, one, so I'm going to pause this video and come back when I have a full working list.